Please introduce yourself, state your name and DOC number for the record. My name is Omri Colon, and my DOC number is 637101. All right, Omri, my name is Brent Kelsey. Along with me is Mr. Roche and Mr. Freeman will be your panel. Explain the process to you, read some information to the record, have a parole interview, ask you some questions. You can respond. At the end, you can make a statement. We'll take a vote. You understand the process? Yes, sir. Omri Colum. DOC number 637101, you're a third class offender. Pro eligibility date 329 2023, good time 311 2025, full term 329 2026, eight year sentence for this come up. second degree battery, accessory after the fact, second degree murder. Does that sound correct? Yes, sir. Okay, would you answer Mr. Roche's questions, please? Yes, sir. Good morning, Mr. Cologne. How are you? I'm great, sir. Good. Mr. Cologne. Yes, sir. Let's talk about your disciplinary issues. Sure. You, have, you have disciplinary problems. In June, specifically on June 20th, 2022, only 13 months ago, you got a write-up for contraband. You pleaded guilty, and you were found guilty, and you lost 30 days good time. Yes, sir. Correct? Yes, sir. The next day, on June 21st, 2022, you got another write-up for contraband. You pleaded guilty, and you were found guilty, and you lost 60 days good time. Is that correct? Yes, sir. You also been revoked on two or three occasions. You have a very poor supervision record. You have a moderate risk assessment to tell us that you have a moderate chance of reoffending. And you also have strong law enforcement opposition. I'm basically telling you, Mr. Cologne, that I cannot vote to release you because you've had two disciplinary write-ups, two very serious disciplinary write-ups in the last 13 months. And you have a moderate chance of reoffending. You understand what you said? Yeah, I do understand what you said, sir. You have to keep your nose clean. You have to be right up free for at least a year and a half or two years before I can even consider releasing you because you can't follow the rules when you're incarcerated. How are you going to follow the rules when you're on supervision? So you got 13 months right up free. You need to get another at least six to 12 months right up free, and then maybe right back for a rehearing. Okay? Yes, sir. This is Kelsey. All right, would you like to make a statement on your behalf? I mean, sir, at the, at the moment I was, uh, when I caught those write-ups, I was uh, under the influence and I was using drugs, but at the time I, uh, I've been rehabilitated. I've got uh, 11 certificates. I've been, uh, I took the substance abuse. I took the anger management. I've been getting help. And uh, if I can get granted Mr. parole. Mr. Okay. Mr. Colon, okay. I don't doubt, I see all your programs. And that's what worries me. If you completed all those programs and you still not following the rules and regulations, I need to see a longer period of time where you follow all the rules and regulations. I see your program. All the programs that you completed in 22 and 23, which also had those two write-ups back to back. Mr. Kelsey? I understand, I understand okay. sir. Yeah. Okay. But, All right. Well, go ahead. If you want to make another statement, go ahead. 
I mean, I was going to say, I mean, that was over a year ago. And at the time, I was just at a bad place. And I, like I said, I was using drugs. And uh, I don't use drugs anymore. I, I, like I said, I've been clean. And I've been participating in pro programs since 2021. Right. And, okay. and I mean, I have I've completed 11 programs. And okay. I have a job. I have a job waiting for me, my boss. I have a job waiting on me, a place to live, transportation. I have three daughters. Uh, uh, my daughter's trying to get in college. She really needs my help financially. Uh, I, I just really need to be out there so I could help support my family. I mean, okay. I learned my lesson. I really learned my lesson for what I did. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank you for your comment. Does panel prepare to vote? Yes. Mr. Roche? Uh, based on a general disciplinary conduct that's totally unacceptable. Two contraband write-ups in June of 2022, a moderate risk assessment score, poor supervision in history, and law enforcement opposition. I deny your request. Mr. Freeman? I concur. Okay, two, two votes to deny. I'm also going to vote to deny your parole for the same reasons. Keep working hard. And maybe it'll be a different uh, outcome next time if you can stay right up free. Three votes to deny. Today, your parole's been denied. Good luck to you. And All right. Do at 11 well, it, at Catahoula. You say I could file for a rehearing? Yeah, mm -hmm. you, they can tell you how to do it, uh-huh. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you. Thank you.